Are we recording? We're recording. Great, great, great. Welcome, guys. Dr. Mo, digital nomad physician at digitalnomadphysician.com. So I get this asked a ton, and I'm like, yeah, I, got, I, got, I just got to put this out there. You, got, you guys just need to know what this is because I get it asked all the time. How do I find a good practice software? So you're either a telemedicine physician, you're starting your own practice, you're hopefully becoming a health coach, as I've been talking about uh, to no end, and you need some sort of a practice software. You need a place where you can document stuff and you need a place where you can book appointments and uh, schedule follow-up and bill the patient, a place where you can give them some documents to fill out ahead of time. So for example, I'm taking uh, this nutri functional nutrition course, and of course, uh, I need to give my clients some of these really wonderful handouts and some of these things that I want them to fill out. Well, how are they going to do it? I'm not, I don't want to fax it to them. I don't want to email it to them. It's not that it's unprofessional. It's just I don't want to have to go through each and every one of those steps all the time. So I came up with three great uh, options. Um, these, are, these are my top three. These are my, these are my top three um, for practice software for Basically, anybody who's a health coach, maybe a dietitian, a psychotherapist, um, women's health, maybe outside of clinical medicine, or anybody who's a yeah, family medicine doctor, a GI doctor, anybody who wants to do something a little bit less clinical. And the reason I say that is because sometimes when you want to do something full on telemedicine, it's probably better for you to just go with a traditional telemedicine software. And I'll do another episode all about that. I'll give you the top three uh, telemedicine softwares that I use and recommend um, that have everything built in. But I'm not a big fan of a lot of them, and I'll go, I'll go over that later. Anyway, so let's start with this one, practicebetter.io. Practicebetter.io. I guess it's just called better. Uh, simple, straightforward pricing. They really do. They're, one thing I love about these guys they're functional. You can bring on a lot of different clinicians. You can collaborate together. You can share documents. Uh, the billing portal is really easy. And uh, yeah, you can upgrade and downgrade at any time. So what's their plan structure like? I would love to move my beautiful face out of the way so you guys can see this. All right. Mm, okay. So you can start at zero, which is great because you can just trial it, right? You can have up to three clients. You get 100 megabytes of storage. You have a secure client portal. By the way, 100 megabytes will go super fast once you upload a few videos and episode, um, uh, audio audio files and documents that you want your clients to fill out. Dude, gone, gone. So one gigabyte is more than enough. You're never going to need more than that. Um, unless, of course, you're a huge practice. But the, those of you guys who are following me, you're, you're not trying to have a huge practice. You're trying to have 100 patients at most. You're trying to have a sustainable life for crying out loud. We're not, we're not going back to the whole Western medicine crap. We did it. We failed. We didn't like it. Okay. So you get a secure client portal. This is important. So it is HIPAA compliant and also PIDA compliant, right? Uh, I guess, is that the European or Canadian version? I don't know. Uh, you get a good app. It's pretty decent. I've checked it out. It's a, it's a great app. Um, you get a chart notes, you get templates. By the way, better uh, practice better is my number one choice. That's why I'm going over this one first. <laughs> so uh, if you're just going to turn the video off after this, great. You, you got the best recommendation. Um, and actually, I'll save you some time if you want to turn off the video right now. The next one is gethealthy.com. Gethealthy.com. Here's what it looks like on top right there. And then the next one is simplepractice.com. And here are their pricing structures. So for those of you who want to go check it out on your own, peace out, take care. For the rest of you diligent folk, check this out. So the other thing you get is um, scheduling and billing. And I think that's a huge one, guys. You think you, oh, I'll do it myself. I'll do it through Calendly. I have Calendly. I use Calendly all the time. And it's incorporated with a lot of my other stuff. But I don't want to. I want to use Calendly for what I use it for. And I want to have when my when a client comes on and wants to do heart health coaching with me, I want them to go straight to my website. I want it to be integrated. I want them to schedule and do all the billing and everything there. I can refund them money there. I can charge them. And if, they, if they're a no-show, I still charge them. I want all that stuff to be pretty seamless. Now, once you pay a little bit more, so you go to the everything in Sprout, whatever that means, you, you can do up to 10 clients. And remember, if you one of your clients leaves and you get another client, 
stays the same. So it's not like only 10 clients forever. So for example, in my practice, I don't do more than probably five clients at a time, right? So I deal with like two or three people at a time. So whenever I'm done with someone, I have another one come in. I'm definitely not one of those health coaches who wants to have a patient or client with me forever. I want them to be with me for three months, a year, two years max, and then boom, get out of here. Next person. Um, I think that works the best for me, for my personality type. So you get one gigabyte of storage for 20 bucks a month. You get telehealth video chat, and this is per month. This is literally per month, which you'll see with the other services, their, their billing is kind of weird. Some of them bill you for the entire year. But I think when you're a really good software company and you're willing to charge somebody just month to month, you don't need to lock them in for the entire year, especially when you know that you can retain them and probably convert their friends, which are you guys. So invoicing and payments, so I can send clients invoices and you know send bills to them. Um, there's a food database. Um, th they got this whole thing with like working with health coaches and uh, dietitians and nutritionists. So there's a lot of that barcode scanning. And um, I didn't really figure out what that barcode scanning was. Anyway, uh, the telehealth video chat is pretty cool. It looked uh, pretty seamless. Um, and they got this really cool food journaling thing. So especially for those of you who are health coaches and doing a lot more, like I'm doing this functional nutrition course. I want I guess I want my health coaching clients to really get involved with their food and maybe scan some things. I don't want to review any of that scan stuff though. So, but for those of you who care, that's what it's for. And then here, if you bump up, you can do group scheduling. So especially if you are doing oncology or maybe working with pediatric patients and you want to bring the partners in or the caregivers, I think this is a really good one at $49 a month. Um, and then uh, Zapier integrations up here is like a, I think it's like Slack, could be wrong, no idea. And then at 79, uh, you get a lot more storage. That probably makes sense, I think, for unlimited clients. So this is probably for multiple clinicians. I think they charge you like an extra $15 per month for another client, for, for another clinic, clinician that you bring on, but they just, uh, but they don't charge you extra for any other uh, support staff. You have like a bunch of support staff support. Um, the personalized URL and branding starts at 79. And this is really important for you guys to check out. If I have uh, cardiachealthcoach.com and I want them to click on my website and then immediately transition and stay on to cardiachealthcoach.com, they wouldn't be able to see what kind of practice software I use. Not that that's important, but it's really nice because it's really seamless and the client, the customer always feels like they're in that same environment. and. Uh, so this is kind of nice, and I think it's professional. Believe it or not, for a lot of us, especially if you're going to do telemedicine, a dedicated fax number is really good. And I think this is this is probably a practice better soft, uh, the practice better online platform is probably amazing, incredible for anybody who wants to do very basic telemedicine. Nothing complicated, nothing too crazy. You don't want to bill insurance, obviously. This this is not what you want to use for billing insurance. <laughs> I hope I made that pretty clear. And I don't even do anything with insurance, so yeah. Um, and then, yeah, this is like um, more of an enterprise build, so it gets pretty complicated there. Uh, that's it. That's that's really everything I can say about this one. Um, you can do, S yeah, you can do SMS integration. Uh, they have APIs that you can build into other software. Uh, it's it's wonderful. Uh, I mean, I think for anybody who wants to who wants to just have a little bit of um, a mix of maybe telemedicine and a little bit of health coaching, this dude, you're going to be solid with this. You're not going to go wrong. And I actually know of a few fairly reputable companies that will online uh, health platforms, health service places that use this. And I, I really recommend their, everything that they write up is really good. There was one demo, which is super boring to watch, but if you wanted to kind of get a sense of what it looks like, um, you can check out this. I was going to show you guys like an actual, like my demo, like, not my demo, but like my software and what it looks like for me. But uh, I don't know. I think you guys will get a good enough sense by watching one of these videos. So uh, hopefully you guys can see it. But this is sort of the screen over here. Um, my schedule, the practice, you got your patients, the clients coming up. You got uh, scheduled tax documents and tasks documents that you can upload, billing, payments. You can go to individual clients. So pretty solid. I mean, should... Uh, should satisfy most of most of you guys who need any kind of basic but easy to navigate uh, platform. All right.
The next one, which I'm not happy about for a few reasons. The good thing about them is they stay monthly, but they give you kind of a good, pretty good discount, 10% discount for doing annual, which is kind of like, ah, oh, come on, just, just do it. Um, you know, just list the price to me monthly. When you say 45 a month, why are you saying annually? Right. So, um, anyway, for, at, at zero, you get 10 clients, you get some scheduling software, you get the telehealth, you get the Android app, you get the iOS app. So that's pretty cool. Like for very little upfront, for zero upfront, you sign up, um, you, you get to practice, you get to work in that environment with up to 10 clients to really see if it's the right fit for you. Now, let me tell you guys something. Any of these platforms that you find that you really want to use, even if you have more than the number of clients that they recommend, they will let you probably use it for the first six months, three months for completely free without paying anything because they really want to make sure that you like this. Okay. So that's, that's one thing. Uh, always email them, contact the salesperson and have them work something out with you. Um, one thing is you, you get e-fax, e you get a dedicated e-fax and outbound e-fax. Remember, sometimes you have to fax uh, certain prescriptions even to uh, herbal supply stores and like, uh, of course, uh, pharmacies. So sometimes that integration is a little bit more complex. Um, they do have, uh, I think I mentioned this, that they got payment processing and they got telehealth, which I think is pretty good at zero. And then as you go up, you can kind of do the group chat. You can see there's group healthier. You can do group messaging and individual uh, text messages, but it's a bit more pricey. And I'll say that I haven't test driven this one, but from all the documentation and everything else, it just didn't look that um clean and professional that I, that I would want. I don't know how much support there is behind it. It might be great. It might beat the hell out of the other one, but I ju I'm just letting you know. Um, they, they, all of every one of these that I'm showing you guys is HIPAA compliant. So there's really uh, nothing to worry about there. They do allow you to build forms, forms for uh, your healthcare clients or your customers or your patients to fill out. They have a client portal. So that means the your patient can see their portal and everything you share with them over there. You can set up goal and metrics, which all of them do. Uh, there's a there's a library of documents that you can share with them, whether it's videos or uh, exercises, stretches, audio audio that they can download. So that's why I said like your gigabytes are going to go up really quickly. The good news is you can also send them a link and have your stuff hosted on Google or OneLink or any any one of those other websites. OneDrive, OneDrive, not OneLink. Um, the eFax I mentioned. I'm not going to talk about anything like um, labs and stuff like that. A lot of them will integrate into labs pretty basically. Uh, none of these are going to be so seamless. Um, but again, it kind of depends on what it is that you need. Uh, calendar integration, chat and email, support. Yep. And API access. API access is really only available for most of these actually at the enterprise level when you pay a lot. API means they basically will give you their entire software in this little package that you can integrate, have your backend computer designer put it into any, any kind of part of your website that you want. So um, that's this one. Yeah, pretty good. Uh, there was... Oh, I was going to show you guys what the what the screenshots of it look like but i think if i remember correctly it wasn't easy to find <laughs> oh here okay so very similar right very similar to the other ones you got tasks you got patients coming up you got scheduling you got billing you got forms um you got fa faxing information you got lab you got reports and you got the patient portal where they can go simple straightforward okay and the last one no not necessarily because it's any worse or anything like that, um, but this is just the only other one that I wanted to mention is Simple Practice. They're in fair competition with these other companies. It starts a little bit higher. So you start at 29, then you go to 69 and 99. Unfortunately, even at 69, you have to pay about $15 for telemedicine, if I remember correctly. Okay, fine. I'll make my freaking face small. All right. So what do you get? Um, at 29, you get unlimited clients, paperless intake, client portal, appointment reminders doesn't come in until the middle tier, uh, text support doesn't come in on the, until the middle tier, appointment online, online appointment, online appointment requests, all of them have it. This one doesn't come in until the middle tier. So remember that. Uh, and then calendar syncing doesn't come in until the end. And that's kind of a big deal for me. I definitely need whatever kind of scheduling software I use for any platform. It needs to link to my Google Calendar. That's why you. That's where I do all of my uh, scheduling. 
um, appointment widget, progress notes. Yep, all of them support all the classic documents and intake and everything else that you're going to do. All of them have billing, uh, so monthly recurrent for those of you who are going to do direct primary care, for those of you who do concierge. Um, all of them have that support. And then I'm not, I mean, mobile app, all, yeah, so here mobile app is supported even at the cheapest, at the lowest price. Um, but again, I haven't really played around with this, with these last two. I really played around more with better, uh, what's it called, practice better. Uh, and yeah, I think uh, that one was already pretty good and a great price. I, I doubt a lot of you are going to go with any other competing ones. Um, that's the one I've recommended to all of my uh, coaching clients so far. Everybody uh, whom I work with goes with this. And again, I'll do a dedicated video talking about all the different type of telemedicine platforms. If you're going to build out like a high volume, hardcore telemedicine platform and you want to bring on other physicians, dietitians, nutritionists to work on that platform, great. Then I will talk about that as well. But this is really geared <clears throat> towards someone like myself who wants to have health coaching and telemedicine patients, but I want to have low volume, higher cost, right? So this is ideal for that. That's it, guys. If you have any questions, email me, drmo at digitalnomadphysician.com. You can check out the website, digitalnomadphysician.com. I hope this is helpful. Leave some comments. Let me know. Do you want to hear about other stuff? Is this helpful? Is this not helpful? Do you hate it? Do you love it? Take care.